Hi, hello, welcome back. This video is all about creating a new data set from an existing CSV file into a Google BigQuery console. If you have seen my previous video, we have just created um, the data set as an empty table. We also define the schema manually as well as inserted data into the table using the insert statement. Okay. So in this video, let us now try to upload a CSV file into the Google BigQuery console. In order to do that, log into the Google BigQuery console. And this is my first project, which is the default project. Okay. Uh, let us now create a new data set. Just click on the three dots here and click on create data set. For this training purpose, I have a CSV file which contains the details about a global superstore. It contains the customer information uh, like the customer ID, the name, the city where they belong to and as well as the profit and the sales information. OK, let us try to upload this CSV file. So data set ID, I'm making it as general as stores. And the data location, I'm selecting Asia South 1 Mumbai because this is my nearest location. This data set I'm creating only for the demo purpose and I do not want it for a longer duration. So if that is the case, then I'll enable this table expiration. So this will expire my table in the specified number of days. I'm specifying it as five. My table or the data set will get expired in five days. Just click on create data set. You can see the data set is created in our first project. This doesn't have any information or any tables created under it. Let us now try to create a new table. Click on the three dots and select create table. This time I wanted to upload a CSV file. So I'm going for the option upload and let me select my file. I have selected my CSV file and the file format is automatically selected as CSV. And uh, here, if you see here, the project, it is default. The data set is stores and the table name, I'm keeping it as global superstore. Okay. So the table type is native table. I wanted to detect the schema automatically. So I'm just selecting this option. This will help me to detect the schema automatically. The data set is very small, so I do not need any partition or cluster setting. So I'm just going for create table. Let's wait until the table is created. If you see here under the stores data set, our table is created. So just click on the global superstore. The schema contains the information about the different columns which are available in the data set. So all these is automatically um, read by the Google console. Even the data types are automatically detected. Let us go to details in order to see the table size and the number of rows, the created days and so on. If you want to preview the data, you can just click on the preview tab and uh, have a look at the data. OK, so this is how we create a data set um, from an existing CSV file in the Google BigQuery console. Thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.